Hello, this is AD of AD Flix, and you're watching use of OBS Open Broadcast Software Studio in Google Meet. Let's go. And before we get into our video, I hope you subscribe to my channel and like, share this video on your Google Meet friends and how you should use OBS Studio on Google Meet first of course we need some prerequisite software you need to install of course you need OBS Studio go to their official website and download which uh, operating system or OS you're running with Windows, Mac OS, or Linux, and for Google Meet, I think there's no program here. No. Uh, I think there's a program here, but uh, I don't know where is it. No, or you can just use your web browser for Google Meet, or you get invite for the Google Meet. Or you want to start your own meeting on Google Meet? Just use your browser. And two more software we need. That is uh, BP Audio software, which is the virtual audio cable. Just search it on your browser and BP cable. Install it on your OS you are using with. And of course, you need the audio monitor plugin for the OBS. Download it and choose your OS you are running with the Mac OS or the Windows installer. Download that and install it in your computer. So when you install that, this is what the your <laughs> OBS will look like. Blank screen but with one scene and a prompt that will appear to you is a auto configuration wizard for this you will only choose i will only be using the virtual camera click next and apply the settings and you don't need to go to the settings and go through that the settings is already been uh, set up for you it's an auto configuration. So, OBS configure it that you only be using OBS for your virtual camera. So, how can you get your your video and your audio into your Google Meet? So, from OBS to Google Meet, how can you do that? So first we need to insert some sources and scene for me i separate my audio mic where my video will be my camera and i put it that on one scene together so first i set up my scene for audio mic and i put my source my source for this is audio input capture and I choose the mic I'll be using which is on your properties and I choose that mic and for your videos you can choose your videos here oh, I don't have a video here huh I'm gonna browse a new video and so for your video you need a media source or if you're going to play a multiple videos you will insert a VLC a VLC or a media source so media source from that you will 
you'll need to search for your file browse your file for your prepared video to source or if if you don't have video source you can display capture of one of your monitors so next is your camera so i won't be adding any camera here oh i can add something just wait for a moment so for your camera add source which is the video capture device video capture device then search through the camera you need to choose i'm gonna choose this one then let's go and i have my camera this is um youtube i'm trying to do this <laughs> <laughs> so for your live camera this is your live live which is a combination of your audio mic scene and your video scenes uh, for example i'm gonna edit this uh, then your live will be your video and your audio mic and for your live camera it will be the combination of audio and your camera and for live silence no come this will be like a silence no mic no come it's like a mute safest way to mute unmute and no camera on your side so how we can do this on your google meet that is just set up for your uh, so this is your google meet for now um, what you are seeing is my video is cam on and my microphone is on so uh, we need to start the virtual camera so for you to have your oh no uh, for you to have your camera but how can we flip this can we flip this effects should we add some visual effects camera on oh This will be the problem if we need to flip this your videos should be on flip mm, filters add some filter on your scene then If that will be the case, you need to flip your videos. For example, this one. I flip this one, and we should see on your camera. Okay, it's on flip. And for your audio, you need to choose a new audio everything on your scene will be heard settings and then settings and your microphone should be cable output vp audio virtual cable this is the the one you uh installed your virtual cable choose that as a default 
allow that and as you can see when we're speaking it's also been occurring here and the audio here will be not yet be heard on your so go to your videos go to the filters go to the o add some audio monitor which we downloaded the plug in the audio monitor plugin first for the first audio monitor you should put the cable input and the next one will be your preferred audio monitor if, the, if you want to hear the sound of your video for yourself not on the, the google meet guys on your google meet so choose this one choose the audio monitor which device you want to hear your video audio and same thing for any videos you will add it here now and for your mic you only need to add the cable input for your audio monitor and that's it that's how you will uh use the google meet application the google meet uh, the obs application to your uh zoom meeting so again guys uh thank you for watching the video and uh, i hope you subscribe to my channel and uh, see you guys on the next video bye bye why i cannot beep on my avatar <laughs>